BeerReviews.com on location yet again, but guess what? We're going to do a good beer review tonight. We are going to talk about this uh, Long Trail Brewing Company, Long Trail Ale. Um, brand new brewery. We've never reviewed anything from these guys before. Um, if my research stands corrected. Um, one of the things about this beer, it's been around since 1989. I've never heard of it, but kudos to them for being around that long. They're out of Vermont. Um, it's a full body amber ale, amber ale brewed with fermented house yeast that has a complex and clean flavor. So that's kind of boring, but it says in 25 short years, I like that, our flagship brew has weaved its way into the Vermont landscape and become a Green Mountain tradition as the 272 miles of the long trail itself. So. I'm not familiar with the long trail, but 272 miles, if anybody can do that, they definitely deserve a beer afterwards, and a good one. Um, pl uh, plenty has changed since its first batch, so when it rolled off the line, but one thing remains constant with this long ale, uh, presence at ski hills, cookouts, and get-togethers all over the East Coast. 5% uh, ABVs, 28 IBUs, it is considered an amber. Um, Lighting is not good, I realize that, but it's got this cool hike, hiker on the on the top of the cap here, and it's in the inside it says a taste of Vermont. So you can't see this, I know that, but it's got the state of Vermont with the trail that, that crosses essentially east to west the entire state of Vermont. So um, that is pretty cool. I'm going to do my best to put a link on our YouTube channel and our website of this long trail so let's get into the beer see what it looks like tastes like uh, classic amber ale very very filtered very little head uh, nothing residual floating around um, nice kind of somewhat caramely head on it but very thin perfect color very copper smells like an amber should be bready um, yeasty sweet caramel um, very malty a little bit of that um, there's a little bit of hops that actually come through here I, I would I would guess they were more like Simcoe hops but um, maybe Centennial hops you can definitely smell a little bit of a hop, hop background to it um, but 28 IBUs you know again you shouldn't have much and there's so much mold that kind of hides it but it's got a nice smell to it I like it a lot so um, cheers let's get into it Oh man, that's good. It's sweet on the front, a little bit of sugary, a little bit of caramel, lots of malts, but it's very, very well balanced. Middle of the mouth, it just dissipates really quickly. It's got a nice little kind of background to it of uh, the breadiness, a little, there's definitely a little bit of residual in there, of a little bit of fruit sweetness. It's very subtle. It dissipates like that. Um, it's very easy to drink. This is a really good amber, actually. This is one of the best ambers I've had in a long time. It's very well balanced on the on the aroma side. You know what you're going to get on the front end, but then it just dissipates real quick on the palate. It's very smooth. There's no bite to it. 5% it should, shouldn't be, but at the same time, it's something that I think, like I said, having it at a cookout after a long hike, hike this would be extremely refreshing. Um, it's not overly nutty, which I like a lot. Um, a lot of these beers get... Just the ambers, I think, try to overpower the, the nut side into the nut brown type of uh, classification. And I think a lot of ambers go way bad very, very quickly. Um, I like this beer a lot. I really, really, I would definitely buy this again. Um, this is probably one of the best ambers I've had all year. I don't drink a lot of ambers, so I'm critical about them, and I want them to be really good. This is a very, very good one. So. Long Trail Ale out of Vermont. We rate our beers between one and five. I would honestly give this a four, if not a four and a half. And our rating scale between one and five for what it is for an amber ale. This is probably one of the best I've had in at least a year. So um, let us know if you tried it. Leave comments on your channel or website. We appreciate you watching. We upload all the time. And we appreciate, uh, once again, if you uh, can provide some comments for the beer reviews that we do, we'll see you again.